Let's make a bomb icon on PowerPoint. So first on a blank slide, go to Insert, go to Shapes and pick this oval shape over here. Holding down Shift, just drag it like that. Done. Then go to Insert, go to Shapes and pick this rounded rectangle and just drag it over on top of it. Done. For the next step, I'll just smooth the yellow dot over here a bit. Done. I'll just drag over all of this. Go to Merge Shapes and Union them together. Done. For the next step, I'll, what I'll do is just go to Insert, go to Shapes and pick this arc over here. And holding down Shift, I will drag it like that. Done. Now you can see it's quite the basic shape is ready. Now I'll click on this. I'll go to Shape Outline. I'll go to Weight and increase the weight to about 6 points. I'll go to Weight. Shape outline again and make it 15% lighter black and shape outline I'll make no fills. Now I will click on this little spot over here or maybe this form a shape box over here and window will pop up I'll go to line and I'll make the cap type round and the joint type round and it smooths out the bomb a bit. I'll increase the points a bit right. Alright done. And now what I'll do is click on it Go to home, go to format painter and paint the format on top of it. Alright, done. Now our bomb main thing is almost ready. I'll group them and maybe shrink them a bit like that. Done. Now I'll click on this and con press Ctrl D to duplicate it and you rotate this like this and put it right over here like that and maybe you know make it something else like this light ash color so that it serves as the reflection or something yep it should work just fine I'll just duplicate once more and rotate it like that and put it right over here and with the yellow dots I'll just minimize this a bit yep, this should work just fine done and for the explosion part I'll go to inside go shapes and you will have these automatic explosions I'll just drag over it there and I'll click on this, go to home, go to format painter and paint the format on top of it. And you will have this, you know, something not right roundish things. What I have to do is just go to gap type and make it square, join type make it uh, milter. Yep, this should work just fine. And I'll go to shape fill and make it white. And that's how you do it. What I'll do, I'll decrease the width a bit and put it like that. And our bomb icon on PowerPoint is ready to boom. Thanks for watching. If you like this video, don't forget to hit the subscribe button and there will be one new video every Friday. So don't forget to hit the subscribe button so that you can get a new video every Friday and become a PowerPoint pro. Thanks for watching.